control and then you'll die <laughs> Welcome back, Coinaholics. DJ Numismatics here, and uh, I got two boxes of halves today from the bank. I was lucky enough to uh, get my order in, and they got two in for me this week, and I had enough money to pick up both boxes. Of course, you can see, as you can see here, there's 50 rolls on top of a box, and if anybody's familiar with String and Sons uh, boxes, one of them decided to tear open. I was so frustrated that I didn't even check this thing for enders except for one and I put it right here at the beginning because I do believe that right there is silver I don't see a mint mark but we'll find out here soon because that will be my first roll now I will be looking through these since the last time I didn't find any silver so I'll be looking for silver of course but I'll also be looking through varieties I pull my 71 D's my 72s, my 73Ds, my 74Ds, and my 77Ds aside to check them for uh, the major double dies on them. Uh, I'll go through 10 rolls and pull them all aside because it's kind of faster to have them aside and, uh, and go through them all at once. So once I get through 10 rolls, if I find any varieties in the first 10 rolls or so on and so forth, I'll bring you in and uh, we'll go over what we find per 10 rolls on variety wise. I will bring you in on all the NICs, all the silvers, and it's easy enough without a magnifier to look at the 72D and 82P for the NOFG. So if I find those, I'll bring those in too. And of course, I'll bring you in on Magic Coins or any other major varieties that we find that I don't have to scope. Um, that being said, Let's uh, start it off with this one. Let me crack this open and I'll bring you in if we got silver. I figured since I thought it was silver, I'd bring you in. It's not, it was just a corroded 71D. These coins I usually don't even check for varieties. I only look for the double die on, on the, the better coins. So let me go ahead get on with the search and like I said I'll bring on in on what I talked about see you soon we're on roll 7 and we're gonna have our first find and that's a 2003 NIFC minted endeavor and as you can see I haven't quite got to start checking the DDOs and DDRs all right, let me get back to this roll. We are on roll 43, and we got NFC number two. That's a 2007 from Denver. In pretty decent shape. All right, let me finish up this roll. Well, that first box just got, uh, had the two... NFCs, and then I got a bicentennial that's in pretty good shape, and I don't know if you can see the toning from it, but it's kind of a pretty coin, so I might just keep that for my collection. It's got a really pretty gold toning to it, so let's go ahead and rip into box number two. Let me uh, pause it for a second here and I'll rip that top off. Well, I'm not seeing anything that screams silver, so let's go ahead and see if there's some inside the rolls. And just like last time, I'll bring you in on the NICs and uh, I'll do 10 rolls and search them and if I find a variety, I'll bring in at the end of 10 rolls. Wish me luck. We're on roll 11, and I've got a 1982P. And I've flipped this, so let me flip it for you, too. If you ask me, that is definitely a no 
F G. Let me uh, throw it under the microscope and let you see a close up on it. As you can see, where the F G, whoop, let me see, focus, focus, focus. There we go. Where the F G is supposed to be, there is definitely no F G in there. Not even a trace. That is cool. That's my first 82 no FG that I found. I found a 72 ones, but I sent it in to get graded and it came back as uncirculated details and the back was scratched, so somebody probably altered it. But this one here, I can tell has not been altered. Pretty cool find. Same roll. And we're gonna have NIFC number three first out of this box, and that's a 2016D. Roll 50. And just like the first box, we got a 2000 and 5 NIFC. Two NIFCs in two boxes. Alright, I'll finish off this roll, and then I got a stack of stuff to put under the scope. Well, I went ahead and scoped that pile and I did not find any DDOs in there, so. Ended up with four NAFCs out of two boxes. A 2016, a 2007. I think this 2007 may be a satin finish. I'm not positive. A 2005 and a 2003. And then we got that 1982P no FG and then I'm gonna check my album and see if this thing upgrades it's just that uh, toned 76 so not too exciting of a hunt no silver of course four NFCs in two boxes that's not the biggest find of all but I tell you what that no FG 82 made up for all of it so until next time I'll post a link up here for my eBay page Take a look, maybe you'll find something you need or like, and uh, hopefully everybody's uh, enjoying this warmer weather. And until next time everybody, happy hunting.